All right. Full disclaimer right here. Listen, if you browse biz, I got nothing against you, all right? I don't think you're fucking stupid. I browse biz myself, all right? Biz is my home board. Biz is the namesake of this channel. Biz vlogs. So obviously, I don't have anything against people that browse biz, all right? Let's get started. Hey biz, how do I get rich without working hard? Hey biz, price of Bitcoin goes up 0.01%. No coiners on suicide watch. No coiners on suicide watch. Why do people make such a big deal if you have a fucking digital asset? I own some Bitcoin, all right? I don't have my whole entire life savings in Bitcoin. Hey biz, I just inherited $1.3 billion. What should I spend my money on? Oh my god. These role-playing faggots on this board. The worst part is that people actually believe them. Like, there was a thread a while ago where someone literally said that they were inheriting 1.3 billion dollars. And people were replying to the thread like it was real. People actually believed it in some sense. Do not encourage these role-playing people, all right? Hey Biz, I just got my first paycheck of $300. How do I turn this into 24 million by midnight? I'm not greedy, all right? I know it's gonna be hard. I'm willing to practice. Hey Biz, how much money does it take to get a girl like this? And then they show some kind of picture of like, someone that looks like this, or like this, or like this. Hey Biz, I'm 14 years old and I just figured out insurance is a scam. Hey Biz, I just figured out that the whole world is a pyramid scheme. And then there's that one guy that thinks that options are fucking magic and thinks he can outsmart and thinks anyone can outsmart the market with options. Hey Biz, I just started an LLC with some random guy I don't even know and he's screwing me out of money. What did I do wrong? Hey Biz, I have a hundred dollars. How do I invest it? And there's that one guy that posts like once a week. Tell me why I shouldn't get into credit card fraud. Like fraud or any kind of illegal activity is so stupid. It's so fucking stupid. Hey, I'll tell you why not to get into credit card fraud, all right? Like if you steal any amount that would be worth it, the IRS is gonna fucking come after you. And at that point, you have to launder money. And at that point, you're committing two crimes. You have twice the chance of getting caught and getting thrown into jail and fucking raped. Any kind of crime is fucking stupid. All you need to know is the reciprocal altruism principle. Follow that, you're gonna make fucking billions. If not, you're a fucking idiot. Hey Biz, I got this original idea for this business, but I'm not gonna tell you it because I don't want you guys to steal my idea. Listen, ideas are not worth anything. Ideas are worth 0.0, .0 all right? An idea is not enough information to go out and be like, like if someone gives you the idea of starting an online payment company like PayPal, that's not enough to just go out and be like, oh fuck yeah, I'm a fucking millionaire now, hell yeah. You need to know more than that. It's not about the idea, it's about the execution. You think fucking the Winklevosses could have been billionaires off of their stupid social network idea? No. You need to know like, oh, we're also gonna have a system that doesn't allow fees for buyers and for small sellers. We're gonna have a system that makes that profitable still. We're gonna have, you know, like a viral marketing campaign on eBay, stuff like that. Hey Biz, I need someone to help me make money online. Hey Biz, how do I create passive income? Listen. What is the reason that you want passive income? There is no such thing as passive income, except in the case of dividends. Running a site that brings money in, that is not passive income, all right? You have to maintain the site, you have to advertise, you have to fucking manage the inventory. If you're calling that passive income, then 
That's retarded. You're fucking working a shit ton. Any kind of business that you start, you're going to be fucking putting in a shit ton of effort just to fucking do do the fucking legal work, do the fucking thinking of all the marketing and all the fucking shit and the business plans. The only passive income is dividends, all right? Trust me, it fucking takes a shit ton of work, and in most cases, you're not even going to beat minimum wage, all right? All right, then there's that one guy or those two guys on the board that buy physical metals and keep posting them. Why would you buy physical metals? You can just buy an ETF that's the same goddamn thing and you don't have to go to a fucking dealer and hope that he gives you a fair market price. Honestly, the only situation where I would buy physical metals is if I was like some kind of time traveler and I was going like a thousand years in the future or a thousand years in the past and I wanted to bring wealth with me. That's the only situation where you should be buying physical metal. Oh fuck, I'm cold. Oh my god, I'm so fucking cold. The only reason that biz exists is because G was being overran by Bitcoin threads and cryptocurrency threads. So they created biz as a containment board for all this fucking stupid discussion. But hey, what are you gonna do? I mean, it's the only board on 4chan that is closest to my interests. Alright guys, so you tell me what you hate about biz. Tell me which threads you're tired of seeing. And please, like this video. I want to get to 100 likes on this video. If everyone watching this video would press the like button, I could reach my goal in one single day. Please press that like button, it really helps me out. Please subscribe because I have more awesome videos coming. Uh, let me ask you guys, I'm thinking about doing a video on like Netflix worst rated movies. I'm thinking of watching them and reviewing them. I'm thinking about doing a video on like Scientology where I go into the Scientology building and get the personality tests and everything. I'm thinking of doing a video like this except for the TV board on 4chan. You know, uh, tell me what you think of those ideas. Tell me if you even want to see them or just say, no, no, we don't want to hear any about that Netflix shit, alright? Don't make that video. Tell me what you think, all right?